nice. You should open your heart. I wanna see what you so like. Low life, but I'm telling you to go to here when What's up, guys? Welcome back. So today I have a highly requested video when it comes to the Apple Watch and WatchOS. Shout out to everyone that sent messages on Twitter and on Instagram and those that left comments on some of my videos. What we are going to be looking at is this the modular ultra watch face we're going to be explaining this and we're going to be seeing what are the supported devices and what you can do to best customize and understand this watch face so the first thing i have to put out there in order for you to get this new watch face apple showed this off when they were presenting the apple watch ultra 2 but you don't need the new apple watch ultra 2 to be able to have this watch face i have the initial apple watch ultra the original one and i have this watch face but in order for you to get it if you have the apple watch ultra first gen you need to update your watch to watch os 10 and then if you have the apple watch ultra 2 when that device ships it will automatically have watch os 10 so you might need to do like a software update if there is one but in most cases it won't be necessary and in order to update your watch in most cases you need to update your iphone first to ios 17 so the iPhones that support iOS 17 are the iPhone SE second gen or newer or the iPhone XR and newer. And once you update your iPhone, then you can update your watch to watch OS 10. On this watch, if you want to find it, you can click on your Apple watch. And then if you go all the way to the end and click add new watch face, you see that this is the center of all the new watch faces that are here on watch os 10 and if you click here you can see it's the top one and then you can add it there and then be able to customize it i don't think this is available for the apple watch series 9 since it's a modular ultra meant for the apple watch ultra and utilizes the around the bezels since this apple watch ultra has a bigger display now to customize it and best understand this we want to press and hold this and then if we go to where it says edit we have a number of things that we can edit and the first thing that we can edit right here is the bezel now the bezels allows us to be able to show three things the first one you can see it here it allows us to see seconds so all these is what I have these are all seconds you can see it's updating in real time and by the time it makes a complete revolution or it does a 360 that will be counting up to 60 seconds right there and then it begins again so that is the seconds you can have it as seconds and then if you go up again you can see here if you don't want to to have the bezels with uh, information you can just put none and your watch face will basically look like this now if you go again and edit this you can see seconds we saw that but now you can see here we can add depth and if you know the apple watch ultra you definitely know that the apple watch ultra has a depth reading that can go up to 40 meters or 130 feet so if you look on this right hand side you can see there's an m to depict meters and you can see it goes down all the way to 40 meters and if you want to know the subsequent or the associated feet then you can see the feet are there and it goes all the way down to 130 feet so this is a dive computer and when you submerge your watch into the water and start to go down then it will start to show you how deep you are so that's something that's good and then if we go again to the edit and you can see here we have elevation and the apple watch ultra right here you can see this is my current elevation it's showing it to in meters and also is showing it in feet now the newly announced apple watch ultra 2 has an altimeter reading that's a little bit advanced than this and this can go all the way from negative 500 meters below sea level to all the way to plus 9,000 meters to above sea level to be able to see the tallest peaks or the tallest mountain. That's good. If we go and edit the second thing on our Apple Watch, you can see that is the style. Now, the styles that are here are all digital and they have to do with how you change or view the time. You can see we have hours and minute one. And then we have hours, minutes, and seconds, one. 
and we have hours minutes two we have hours minutes second three and then if you go down we have hours and minutes that's style number three and then we have hours minutes and second style number three so you can see it here and depending on what you set this is how your apple watch is going to look and also the style that you choose is going to affect how many complications you are going to have or be able to put on your screen so for example i'll edit this and then i'll choose this hours minutes and seconds that has the rest of the information so that my watch is not as plain this looks good and then also if we go to edit the next thing you can see it's the night mode you have auto night mode where your watch automatically detects night mode and then you see you can keep night mode off and it will have this white screen every day and even in the night or you can just keep night mode on all the time and the one that i like is this one that has auto and for example if you have your watch like this and you put it face down when you raise it up or when you close it like this or lower your wrist you'll be able to see this is how the watch looks and then if you cover your watch or put it in a dark place night mode should kick in soon you can see just tend to night mode and this allows you to be able to read or be able to see around in the dark without being too bright and then once light comes back on you see night mode slowly disappear so that's a cool thing and then also the next thing that we can edit besides night mode is the color now here we have a variety of colors that you can choose and a quick note is that when you are editing the colors you notice that it affects the bezels and the complications but it doesn't really affect the hours and minutes so if i was to set this and let's say if i was to set green as the color you can see how it looks with green this is still white so that's a change that's there and then if you want you can keep it where it has uh, multi-color and it will be it, it just makes your watch more colorful but some people prefer to set their own colors and you can also do that from this now also if we go to the last thing that we can edit here you can see we have complications now in the description of this watch face apple mentioned that you have up to seven complications that you can add in addition to the bezel so if you want to count the bezel that's like eight complications but the reason why you see six complications you can see i have one two three four five six that i can edit and change and the reason for this is because of the style of clock that i chose and the seventh complication can be added when you choose a smaller watch style so for example if we put a shorter style like this one that doesn't take the whole middle section then if we go to edit and go back to complications you can see we now have seven complications as apple has mentioned so one two three four five six seven and this middle one too you can change it to the style that you want if you want to edit this watch face on your iphone you can also do that if you go into your watch face and go to the watch face gallery you notice it's the first one on the new watch page page right there and right here if you want to edit it on your apple watch you can see the same edits that we have here you can make them and you can be able to add them to your watch i'll just increase my brightness a little bit night mode also you can choose between auto on and off and then you can see here you have one seven complications that you can add to your apple watch and also here if you do choose the style of clock that takes the whole middle point then you won't be able to add the seventh complication so this is how it looks and the description basically i went through it i tested it thoroughly let me know what you think about this new watch face it's a good thing that apple didn't limit it to the new apple watch ultra 2 but also the old apple watch ultra that i have here still gets it and yeah it's the coolest watch face so far for the apple watch ultra and it comes in addition to the wayfinder watch face that we got when the apple watch ultra was initially announced so that's about it for me hopefully you found this video informative in a way if you did hit like and subscribe and i'll see you with the next watch face that i'm thinking of explaining
Peace. I come to paralyze the leader red. Rumors antagonize the dinner dates. Some devastation from the paper pain. I make the papa leader red. I only meditate some killage vanilla. Don't spill the conscious, steal the keys. Once was affected, I no longer breathe. I'm wide awake and the atmosphere is solitary. They sit and tie the wave, it's seated like the Navy. We don't like to try to split conversations, flipping on the Bible page.